Guys, this is Brian back with a Bitcoin video. Um, I got a question. What if you would have bought Bitcoin in 2010 and you invested $100 into it? How much money would you have today? And uh, would it have been enough to retire? Would it, uh, you know, if you had diamond hands and you held on, you know, until today or the, the top of the 21 bull market, how much money would you have had? And how much was Bitcoin then? I'm going to show you that in a couple minutes here, and uh, the numbers are going to blow your mind. You know, it's a typical, um, typical crypto story. You know, this happens all the time in cryptocurrency. I watched it happen with the Gala Games not too long ago. You know, you could have bought uh, a million Gala Games for $175 when it came out, and uh, that would have turned out being worth uh, $830,000. For a $157 investment, you know, not quite what the Bitcoin numbers are, but uh, definitely impressive, okay? But first of all, let's cover this chart real quick, okay? I totally believe uh, Bitcoin's doing a ABC correction right now, okay? We had this wedge formation coming up here. We have fallen out of that wedge, all right? And if we take a uh, Fibonacci on this thing and measure this A leg out, and we put this on the C leg over here, going to come right down to that area so, you know so we're looking looking at something like this here a b and i'm thinking it's going to come down to the uh 27 1 27 2 somewhere right around there not financial advice folks at all that i'm just showing you what i see in the charts please do your own research with stuff like that and if you haven't yet please hit that subscribe button if you enjoy videos like this <laughs> I cover 10 to 15 different altcoins, you know, I won't hammer you with videos every day, but uh, I put out, you know, seven to eight videos a day, I, I cover, not everybody holds one crypto, and, you know, if you, if, if you do hold one, I'm sure you're looking into others, so uh, check out some of the videos I cover, you, you might be, uh, might be surprised at what's out there, and, and uh, there's a lot of good, very good, uh, companies out there in the crypto space so just do your own research and look into stuff okay let's get on with this while you're here if you bought bitcoin in 2010 all right this is on coin market cap this is uh the bitcoin chart here the circulating supply maximum supply is 21 million okay if we go down in this chart down to the bottom you will see all-time low in 2013 of 65 dollars okay that's the lowest they had on here all right i'm going to show you what it was in 2010 all-time high of 68 789 remember that clearly all right so if we go up here on bitcoin put this on uh all all right and we are going to go back to Oops, it might go out of your screen, darn it. All right, but uh, I'm going to tell you what it is here. We are in, uh, let's see, October 20th, 2010 was 9 cents. September 17th of 2010, Bitcoin was 0 0.05909, 6 cents. September 17th. 2010 bitcoin was 10 cents so let's get this uh calculator out here and uh point zero six and if you bought a hundred of them whoops i, I apologize <laughs> terrible math point zero we're going to take a hundred divided by point zero six sorry about that divided by six cents would have given you 1,666.6 Bitcoin. We're going to call it 1666. We'll go with that, okay? So, 1666, 1,666 Bitcoin times, let's, uh, let's go with the current price, first of all. 28,046, 28,046.7 seven six okay that would be today's price if you if you held that right now you would have forty six million dollars seven hundred forty six million seven hundred twenty five thousand nine hundred and two dollars okay now if you would have sold that perfectly at the top times the all-time high and i'm going to show you something else that's pretty exciting too that shows the bottom is in um 
you know, I believe that. A lot of people believe that. Uh, I think the bottom's in on Bitcoin for sure. All right, let's go to the all-time high here. The all-time high was 68,789, $68,789.63. If you would have held to the all-time high, Wow, a hundred and fourteen million six hundred and three thousand five hundred and twenty three dollars and fifty eight cents off of a hundred dollar investment. You would have enough money and your kids would have enough money to never work in your lifetime. Wouldn't that a boy oh boy if you could rewind time. Hundred and fourteen million dollars off of a hundred dollar investment in twenty ten, off of six cent Bitcoin. All right, then let me show you something real fast. This is only going to take a second. And please hit that subscribe button. I would appreciate it so much. But if we put Bitcoin on the monthly chart, okay? All right, I'm going to show you something real quick that uh, it's going to make a lot of sense to you, actually, because uh, it's going to show that the bottom is in. You know, we're going to take, this is the top from 2013. All right, we're going to measure top. So the bear market market bottom was 396 days okay say 400 400 days in 2013 let's go to 2017 and see when we hit the bottom okay 2017 is right there so I'm gonna take a second to do this here but it's pretty interesting uh, you know right there say but say 400 days 396 okay 396 days so 400 on the first two let's see where we're at right now with a measurement okay from the top currently today we are at 516 days so 400 days would have put us huh isn't that something right uh right there i mean right there boom you know if, if it is in with every other year, that would have been the bottom right there. So we'll see what happens. You know, this thing has to get a retracement sometime. Um, I believe that, that that is the bottom. That was the bounce off of our 2017 all-time high. You can see that. Boom, right there. Right back here, we bounced off that. And that uh, I believe that's the bottom of Bitcoin right there. So... We'll see what happens from here on out. Thank you so much for watching my video, guys. I very, very much appreciate it. Please hit that subscribe button, and uh, I'll have some more videos out later today. And uh, thank you so very, very much for watching my channel.